Right, hello YouTube. This is my six foot by two by two, well two and a half by two. Predator fish tank. This is the first video going out there on YouTube. So don't blame me if it's crap. We'll get better as we go on. Those are my fish. So we've got a couple of tin foils, mini marble stingray, abundance of parrots, you can blame the wife for that one. An Oscar, Tiger Oscar that is. A Vieja. What else have we got? Gold Sev. I don't know if you can see hiding at the back. There's a true parrot there. And we've got another one here. So we run this tank off a four foot sump. So come through that pipe there. Down into all the sponges. Go further along. It's not the best of sumps, I must admit, and it's not the best of setups the way that the water flows through, but it's better than a canister filter by a million miles. As you can see, the water is nice and clear in the tank. And then um, we've got a six and a half thousand litre pump we got from a local shop. Oh, yeah. I'm just going to feed these guys so you can watch it. And yeah. Like and subscribe, we're going to keep this going, just relatively new to the hobby, about two years now, started off with some guppies, tetras and got a bit bored of that and had an upgrade. Now we've had most of these bar the stingray and the tin foils and the true parrots, so the rest have all been brought up as little babies, one to two inch, as you can see we've got a new addition there. So yeah, let's feed them. So this is what I feed my fish, the kari. It's all they have. Uh, once a week we'll do them uh, a bit of calamari, mussels, prawns, scallops, that kind of thing. But on the whole, we do four times a week with this, an evening, one day of fish food and no feeding on water change day. So what I do with this once a week, We'll do a 50% change every couple, every three days, maybe to four days. We'll change and rinse out the sponges and change the filter frost. As you can see, that's due very soon because there's an awful lot of gunk. But a lot of that is due to the fact that I put new sand in while the water was in. So naturally, a lot of it went down. So yeah, let's get them fed. So, all right, so here we are, guys. So this is how much they have, which is plenty. You've got the veggies and then. Alright, where's the stingray? Over there. So we'll drop these in here and what's the fun happen? Like vultures the pallet fish are, don't give anyone a chance. Golden Gerardo there. He hasn't noticed. I'll put some in on the other side in a minute. So. Oh, here we go. Here he comes. Dexter. If you've seen on my shorts, you'll see a video of Dexter singing, which you'll quite enjoy. The one handed at the back there, we got him last week at the weekend, one from Birmingham. I think the journey stressed him out a little bit. We got stuck in traffic, so I think we stuck in the car for a good two hours. I'll show you what lighting we're using. So all it is, is outdoor floodlights. And we've got three of them on there, I'm only using two at the moment, because you know, I'm trying to keep the energy down and all that crap. Alright, let us know what you think of the tank guys, leave some
comments in the comment section. Let me know what you think, and we'll do this again soon. Take it easy.